start it, see what, see what it sounds like, just to make sure that's what we're dealing with. Yeah. I'm gonna start on doing, I'm gonna probably, you know, try to get everything disconnected and like, you know how you can kind of see down like each side of the frame rails because you know you've gotten everything disconnected? Mm. That'd be a good spot to get to, I think. Yeah. Uh, radiator, probably drain some fluids. I'm gonna work on top now. Oh, uh, yeah, that's true. That needs to come off too. Okay, well, I'm gonna do intake and maybe fuel lines, maybe radiator. And then we'll go from there. Okay. Disconnected from that side, right there. Radiator, everything drained out of the front. And next thing is anything that connects in from this side has to come off. So fuel lines, and then AC pump is loose, and that gets kind of like flipped out of the way. We're gonna set it on a rag over there. Power steering is up out of the way on a rag. Uh, let's see, downpipe is unbolted. So cylinder full coaling mod. Alan, we're doing that too. We're just not going to tell you that we're doing it yet, <laughs> but it will be on your bill. What are you fighting? Oh, uh, housing bolt that seems to be of completely seized in there. So anyway, AC compressor's out of the way. The next day, I'm just gonna, you know, let you do everything. Okay, okay. like usual. Yep. Alright, let's see if I forgot anything. Well, you forgot the jack under the trans, so there's that. We're not there yet, we haven't looked at the engine up yet. So you usually put a jack under the trans. Yep. That helps to break the bell housing loose, right? Well and when you can rock sport. Yeah. Well and when you pull the engine off, you don't want the trans to just, you know, eat the cross member. Oh well, yeah, I That's what my little baby jack's good for. You wanna use baby jack? It's right there. Baby jack's good for that? Baby jack. No, I usually go in between the legs right here, but that's usually something I do first. All right, it's time to come out. Yeah, we got separation. Do once you get a big enough hole, you can put this beast in there. We got to pull it out. Brent's got, and Brent's got a headache. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Wait, no, no, no. Let's... <laughs> A perfect gap guy. <laughs> Here is a good spark plug. Is this one gap good? It is gapped real good. Real good. Okay, let's that one All right, get the other one. Yeah, yeah. Here, let me gap this one real quick. Check that one. <laughs> yeah, that's gap good. <laughs> I can't not laugh. <laughs> Ready? My right arm because it's stronger, but it's actually not. Because my right arm is gonna fucking explode. I'll do nothing now. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Oh, that's fucking scary. Okay, you're done. Bye bye. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh, Alright. Holy cow. Thank you. No, wait. I got this. <laughs> Twelve of them. <laughs> oh my god. It will come out eventually. <laughs> oh! That is cooked! 